But accidents like this are one reason that a Golden Valley lawmaker is calling for seat belts on new school buses. A representative Mike Freiberg introduced the bill on Monday, and reporter Sonia Goins has more on the legislation. Sonia? Mike and Alex, experts say school buses are the safest mode of transportation for students. Now, Representative Mike Freiberg wants them to be even safer. I just looked into it a bit and, you know, found some studies showing it does improve safety to have seat belts in school buses. Now, Freiburg's bill, bill would require lap and shoulder belts on school buses purchased after December 2017. The legislation would require all passengers to wear seat belts. Otherwise, a parent or guardian could have their student opt out by notifying the school district. Meanwhile, some school districts worry about the cost. However, Freiburg says you can't put a price tag on safety. Some school districts do have concerns about the costs of it. Um, in the past, they have also made arguments that uh, it's not, they don't actually improve safety. I think because the NHTSA recommendations come out this year, I think that argument at least is hopefully off the table. Now that cost part remains unknown. We called several school districts and there is no clear dollar figure since seat belts haven't been required. According to the Minnesota State Patrol, there were more than 700 accidents last year involving school buses.